Hello viewers, welcome to Device Manager. It's very annoying if Wi-Fi is not shown in taskbar, even if you got proper network connection. But don't worry, I will take you through some simple steps to solve the issue. Without any further delay, let's get started. Step one, the simplest way to fix the problem is go to start, click on settings, then select network and internet, there click on troubleshoot, In most of the cases, troubleshooting will fix the issue. You can see in my case, I am able to see Wi-Fi after that. If this doesn't help, let's go to step two. Step two, let's check the issue is associated with hardware or not. For that, go to search bar, type CMD, run as administrator, type ping one, 27.1.1.1. If you are getting response like this, then there is no issue with the hardware. Step three, go to start, select settings, network and internet, select network and sharing center, select internet options, Go to Advanced, there click on Restore Advanced Settings, click Apply and then OK. Step 4, press Windows key plus R to open the Run Command window. Type services.msc. Scroll down and look for WLN Autoconfig. Make sure it's running. If not, right-click on it, select Properties, and change setting to Automatic. If it's already running, then do the next method, Step 5. Go to Start, select Settings, Network and Internet, select Change Adapter Options, If Wi-Fi is disabled there, enable it. If it's enabled, then disable and enable it again. If this doesn't fix the issue, let's go to next method. Step six, press start button plus R to open the run command. Type debimgmt.msc. Expand Network Adapter, right-click on your Wi-Fi adapter, and then select Update, choose Browse My Computer for Driver, then select Let Me Pick from a list of available drivers, then choose one where your Wi-Fi was working, install it, and restart the system. If not working, come back to same page. Right-click, select Properties, Power Management, uncheck Allow Power Off, and click OK again. Come back to same page, right click, select uninstall, uninstall driver and restart your PC. It will automatically restart the driver and see if it's showing the Wi-Fi connection. If not, let's go to next step. Step seven, go to settings, click on network and internet. Select network reset. Click on Reset Now. It will reset the network after that restart and see if the issue is fixed. Next method is Step 8. Go to Start, type CMD, run as administrator. Let's try to fix socket error. Type Netch space Winsock space Reset. Hit Enter. Then type net space int space IP space reset space reset log txt and hit enter. It will clear the logs, then restart the system and check if the Wi Fi is showing or not. Step 9 Press Windows and R to open run command. Type msconfig. Hit enter. 
Select Services. Select Enable All, Apply, then OK. After that, restart the device. If the issue still persists, let's move to the final method. Step 10, find network driver from the service provider using some other device having network connection. Go to their official website. In my case, it's HP. Look for network driver. Download and install to solve the issue. That's it. One of the methods will definitely help you to solve the problem. Let me know your doubts and queries in the comment section. See you guys in the next video. Thank you.